Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today we are going to do the banking and the financial awareness GK digest for the month of November 2023. So very important. So wherever the topics are important, I'll make a star. Okay. So keep that in mind. Uh, my name is Ramandeep Singh and I've been teaching on bank exams today from last 13 years. Let's start the session. I'll provide the PDF of this particular class. द लिंक वुड बी अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन डिस्क्रिप्शन में मैं लिंक डाल दूंगा वहाँ से आप डाउनलोड कर सकते हो एस बी आई सर्कल बेस्ड ऑफिसर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री कॉर्स इज अवेलेबल ऑन बैंक एग्जाम स्टडी डॉट कॉम इसका भी लिंक जो है नीचे डिस्क्रिप्शन में अवेलेबल रहेगा वील बी प्रोवाइडिंग वीडियो क्लासेज नोट्स क्विजेज मॉक टेस्ट वीकली क्विजेज एंड इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन गाइडेंस एंड डिस्क्रिप्टिव पेपर क्लासेज आर ऑल्सो अवेलेबल इन द कॉर्स So CCI approved investment by IBEF four of MO Alternatives and SK Finance. ठीक है. The Competition Commission of India ने approve किया है. The has approved the proposed combination relating to minority investment by India Business Excellence Fund in SK Finance Limited. So that is the context. Not that much important. Okay. बट एनी वेज इंडिया बिजनेस एक्सलेंस फंड ने इन्वेस्ट करना है एस के फाइनेंस में ओके सो वॉट इज इंडिया बिजनेस एक्सलेंस फंड अ कैटेगरी टू ऑल्टरनेटिव इन्वेस्टमेंट फंड रजिस्टर्ड विद से बी ओके इतना ही याद रख लें आई थिंक दैट इज दैट इज मोर देन सफिशेंट मनोरंजन मिश्रा हैज बिन अपॉइंटेड एज एग्जीक्यूटिव डायरेक्टर बाई आर बी आई नाउ दिस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट ओके Uh, these kind of questions are asked in the exam. So LIC Mutual Fund, it's an asset management company. Okay. Uh, so Mishra has Manoranjan Mishra has worked with LIC right in the past, and now he's he has been appointed as executive director of RBI. So Mishra has over three decades of experience in RBI, having worked in the area of regulation, NBFCs, and all right. And his appointment is effective from first off. November twenty twenty three. So, who has been appointed as executive director by RBI? Manoranjan Mishra has been executive has been appointed as executive director by Reserve Bank of India. So, that much uh, is sufficient. Manoranjan Mishra, executive director of RBI. इतना याद रखें काफी है. GST collections not really important to remember, but you should know roughly कि कितना कोता है 1.72 lakh crore in the month of October. This is the collection. Okay. RBI has prescribed norms for the closure of DCCB branches. So this is an RBI circular, very important anyways. So this is a circular from October. So this circular was released in the month of October uh, 2023. I have already taught this. I am already कर चुका हूँ. in the in detail in the rbi circulars class please check that okay so anyways i mean if uh, if a district central cooperative bank wants to you know close its bank uh, close its branch so what is the purpose kyun karna chahte hain is it uh, for the customers benefit right why why do they want to do that uh, in case they close that branch is there अनदर ब्रांच अवेलेबल इन द इन द नेबरहुड के आसपास कोई और ब्रांच अवेलेबल है कस्टमर्स का क्या होगा वट अबाउट द कस्टमर्स मनी तो ये पूरा आंसर किया हुआ है ठीक है आई मीन आप सर्कुलर पढ़ें एक बार ठीक है सो द डिसीजन टू क्लोज अ ब्रांच शुड बी टेकन बाय द बोर्ड ऑफ द बैंक द डिसीजन शुड बी बेस्ड अपॉन द इवेल्युएशन ऑफ वेरियस फैक्टर्स Uh, it should be for the benefit of the customers to ensure transparency and minimize the inconvenience to the depositors the dccb must provide a two month notice now that is important two months notice should be provided uh, about the branch disclosure and all the accounts should be transferred to another branch when dccb decides to close a branch they required to return the original license or license issued for that particular branch to the regional office of the rbi uh, that is concerned with the operations theek okay? hai the board of the bank is going to take the decision and uh, the important point here is two month notice is required two month notice is required that question is important sbi and uh, mnm uh, financial services mindra and mindra financial services they have signed a co lending agreement and according to me if you remember the 
the headline that much uh, is sufficient right the sbi is going to provide uh, the loan uh, to the mnm right they'll they'll provide the funding and then they'll further lend money to the general public okay so that much is sufficient to understand itna agar aapko aata hai to kafi hai headline is important so mnm they entered into a co lending partnership so basically the bank is going to provide funding to the, this particular nbfc and then this particular nbfc is going to lend money to people like you and me general public right so mnm and uh, mnm finance and sbi they entered into the partnership so rbi release a norm for regulating fintech cross border payment space now that is really really important i hope you have heard about insta mojo insta mojo very popular uh, payment gateway payment aggregator in the past so they didn't have a net worth of uh, 25 crore that is why rbi cancelled their license now they are not accepting the payments ab wo payment accept nahi kar rahe so basically uh, in this whole uh, circular uh, this particular category the payment aggregators the payment the cross border payment aggregators they need to have a net worth existing non bank payment aggregators cross border they need to have a minimum net worth of 15 crore and for new applicant applicants 25 crore ka net minimum net worth is required for the payment aggregators cross border category payment ag- aggregators if you make an online payment you make it via a payment aggregator for example a razor pay you enter your card details or you make payment by upi right on a website uh, you are uh, communicating with a payment gateway theek hai to insta mojo ka business band ho gaya right abhi that's what it is uh, why net worth ka requirement hai nayi applications ke liye 25 crores for the old uh, uh, you know existing uh, payment aggregators 15 crore chahiye but even they need to reach the 25 crore ka net worth mark uh, by i mean the deadlines are there it should be in the month uh, in 2024 okay so three licenses categories are there uh, for import only for export and for both import and export uh let's move forward for the existing payment aggregators the deadline is 31st of april 2024 for new applicants it is 1st of july 2024 to apply okay so what is the name of the license that is not important the important uh, is the net worth ka requirement that is very very important so wherever i am marking the star that particular point is very important 25 crore ka net worth chahiye new applicants ko uh, is pe 3 star laga dete hain because that is very important okay so please remember that even deadlines are very very important so please remember that okay let's move forward name of the license is not that important the net worth ka requirement is very important okay af li launches super cash plan for regular income and security uh, agias uh, federal life insurance the regular income plan again not that important okay i don't think you'll see such questions in the exam uh but please remember the super cash plan the name of the plan uh, a af li super cash plan that much is sufficient according to me to remember and rbi imposes monetary uh, penalty on pnb and federal bank rbi they keep on imposing penalties wo gal lagate rehte hain right i mean on federal bank pnb even on hdfc bank they imposed a 10 crore rupee ka penalty ye to lakhon mein wo crore mein laga di hui hai a lot of reasons can be there for kyc non compliance for Uh, digital lending non compliance rules non compliance a lot of rules are there by rbi the banks keep on uh, you know doing such mistakes and the rbi keeps on uh, you know imposing the penalties ye hota rehta hai theek hai so i don't think it is re- important to remember the penalty kitna gaya okay which bank was penalized by rbi for non compliance with certain provisions related to interest rate on advances not that important bank of baroda appointed uh, kadgutur sheetal venk uh, venkatas murth as the head of digital channels uh, sorry if i pronounced it wrong but that is uh, i won't say that is important please uh, please note that only uh, in case of uh, psu banks or the private sector banks you need to remember the names of md or the chairman i don't think they are going to ask who is the head of the digital channel so that's not important 
And now that is important. Uh, the name of the mobile banking applications uh, application launched by Bank of Baroda that is Bob World. That is important. I'll mark a star here. Okay. The ACC, the appointments of committee of cabinet. Um, the PSU Bank, um, uh, jo MDs and CEOs, hain, they are appointed by the appointment uh, uh, committee of cabinet. Sorry, they have approved the extension of tenure of two MDs of PSU banks, AS Rajiv of Bank of Maharashtra and Matam Venkat Rao of Central Bank of India. Please remember that. Remember their names. Uh, it's sort of important. You will see such questions in the exam. Uh, who proved the extension of the tenure? It is the appointment committee of cabinet ACC. They approve it. Delhi High Court sets aside the debt recovery tribunals, uh, appellant tribunal. So is it important? I don't think this can be important for legal students, but not here. Okay, it's not so I think it's important. Indescent Bank launches Platinum Rupee credit card with UPI integration. So that's really interesting. And they'll, they provide the rewards on that. So Indescent Bank has re recently launched the Rupee variant of the Platinum credit card, which allows the card holders to earn rewards for their UPI transactions. So earn rewards for their UPI transaction. That is interesting. And they can get rewards for that. Okay, so that is important. Uh, Indescent Bank, they came up with a credit card with UPI integration, kind of important. How much reward is not that important, okay. Reward kitna usko chhod dijiye. Excess Bank and Irma. Irma is one of the well-known uh, management institution. They partnered uh, to promote financial inclusion and literacy. Financial literacy in India. So five-year ka partnership. Okay, very important. Kiske saath partnership kiya? You can find such questions in the exam. This is the kind of question you can see in the exam. Who has partner? Excess Bank partnered to promote financial inclusion and literacy in India in 2023. It's a Irma, okay, Irma Anand. One percent interest rate debate has been announced by the government to the young borrowers to now uh, physically impaired. Uh, they don't use this word. They use the word the young. So, unko ek percent ka rebate diya jayega, right? And which ministry is doing that? Ministry of Social Justice and Empowerment. Now that is important. Uh, I mean, uh, Department of Empowerment of uh, Persons with Disability. Okay, which uh, ministry ke under aata hai? Social Justice and Empowerment. That is important. I'll give it a star. Mera star star lag nahi raha hai, but <laughs> I'll, I'm giving it a star. The IMF Executive Board has approved uh, a 50% quota increased. So, uh, jo, jo quota hai, that has been uh, increased. Quota allocation has been increased. But that is not, uh, I won't say that is not really important from your examination point of view. Okay. Assam launched the app based ASTC cab services and UPI backed a digital payment solution. Okay. For their local transportation. Uh, kind of, uh, if you just remember the headlines, that should be sufficient. Okay. ICIC banks, uh, they get the RBI note to make ICICI. Security is a wholly owned subsidiary of ICC Bank. Now that is important. Even HDFC and HDFC Bank merger is important. ICC Security is going to be a wholly owned subsidiary of ICC Bank. Now that is also very important, I would say. Uh, FedFINA, IREDA, EPAC, Durable, Suraj Estate Developers, they get a note from SBI. They got permission from SBI, uh, SEBI, sorry, not SEBI, uh, SBI, SEBI to float their IPOs. They will IPOs lekar aayenge. Basically, you have IPOs. I will not say that important examination point of view. Ke liye. Federal Bank introduces UPI Lite for small value digital payments. Every other bank is coming up with UPI Lite. So, which bank brought now is not really important because it is not really important. So, here, if I, uh, I mean, now that is important. What is the purpose of UPI Lite? To facilitate small value digital transaction on UPI without entering your pin again and again. Abhi to TV pe bhi baut ad aari hai, you might have heard about this. 
and RBI tells Baja, Bajaj Finance to finance to stop loans under the e-com and the Insta EMI uh, products. So that was in the news, very much in the news. Uh, the RBI stated that uh, supervisory restriction on Bajaj Finance will be reviewed. Uh, why was it Because they were not following the digital lending guidelines. Bajaj Finance. That is why RBI tells the Bajaj Finance to stop the loans under the e-com Insta EMI products. Okay. And RBI directed the Bajaj uh, the finance to stop the lending on its e-com and Insta EMI card. Ye facility is band karne ke liye bola hai. Now this is really really important. RBI circular pure November month mein this was in the news. So everybody was, uh, was talking about this. So very very important. जितने मर्जी इसमें से क्वेश्चन आना है एसबीआई सीबीओ सेंट्रल बैंक ऑफ इंडिया क्रेडिट ऑफिसर सब एग्जाम में आएगा ये रेगुलेटरी मेजर्स टुवर्ड कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट एंड बैंक क्रेडिट टू एनबीएफसीज सो बेसिकली आरबीआई इंक्रीज्ड द रिस्क वेट ऑफ क्रेडिट कार्ड ऑफ क्रेडिट कार्ड लेंडिंग्स ऑफ पर्सनल लोन्स तो दैट्स द पॉइंट ओके तो ये मेन इसका सर्कुलर का फैक्ट था कितना बड़ा है यू नीड टू रिमेंबर रिस्क वेट फॉर कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट उसमें पर्सनल लोन आ जाते हैं पर्सनल लोन्स आर लाइक कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट बट इट एक्सक्लूड्स हाउसिंग लोन एजुकेशन लोन्स व्हीकल लोन्स लोन सिक्योर्ड बाय गोल्ड एंड गोल्ड ज्वेलरी एंड माइक्रो फाइनेंस लोन्स राइट सो इट्स रिस्क वेट यूज टू बी 100% बट नाउ इट हैज बीन इंक्रीज्ड टू 125% ओके प्लीज रिमेंबर कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट एक्सपोजर पे जो रिस्क वेट है दैट इज 125% एंड रिस्क वेट फॉर क्रेडिट कार्ड इट हैज बीन इंक्रीज्ड फ्रॉम uh 125% to 150% for scheduled commercial banks and 125% for nbfcs nbfcs ke case mein 125% ho gaya hai aur scheduled commercial banks ke case mein 150% ho gaya hai 25% bad chuka hai pehle se okay and risk weight for bank credit to nbfc bank they give credit to nbfc or nbfc janta mein aapke mere jaise logo ko loan baantte hain right तो उस पर भी 25 बेसिस पॉइंट का जो है बढ़ चुका है रिस्क वेट एंड दैट इज इट अबाउट दिस पर्टिकुलर सर्कुलर पेपर में क्या आएगा कि कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट का क्या हो गया है रिस्क वेट या शेड्यूल कमर्शियल बैंक्स का रिस्क वेट क्या है क्रेडिट कार्ड रिसीवेबल के लिए या एन के लिए 125 है शेड्यूल कमर्शियल बैंक के लिए डेढ़ है प्लीज रिमेंबर दैट पेपर में यही क्वेश्चन आपको देखने को मिलेंगे एंड दिस इज द क्वेश्चन क्रेडिट कार्ड एक्सपोजर एन बी एफ है और शेड्यूल कमर्शियल बैंक का डेढ़ है सो आर बी इम्पोज अ नाइन्टी पॉइंट यहाँ पे मैं वो लगाना भूल गया रुकिए स्टार ओके पेनल्टी है ऑन एक्सिस बैंक नाइन्टी पॉइंट नाइन टू परसेंट डिट मेंटेन द मार्जिन फॉर द इंट्रा डे फैसिलिटीज नॉट दैट इम्पॉर्टेंट ओके कितना है पेनल्टी नॉट नॉट इम्पॉर्टेंट पी एन बी इंट्रोड्यूस डिजिटल लोन गोल्ड लोन फॉर हैसल फ्री क्रेडिट एक्सेस सो एन इंडिविजुअल कैन अप्लाई फॉर द पी एन बी डिजिटल गोल्ड लोन For their personal needs, amounting uh, ranging from twenty-five thousand to twenty-five lakhs, right now the interest rate is seven point two five percent. Digital loan ke against, ab low hai loan le sakte ho. Now that is kind of okay. Now that is kind of a news. Uh, the people who were sending money from IDFC First Bank to Yuko Bank. Money was not debiting, but it was crediting in the Yuko Bank. Now that was a fiasco that costed eight twenty crore rupee to Yuko Bank. But anyways, the Yuko Bank is uh, is going to debit money from the uh, from the various accounts. जिन लोगों ने भी ये किया उनके account में से card तो लेंगे ही. But anyways, there will be some people जिससे नहीं वसूल हो पाएंगे. So question is not important. Karnataka Bank inks pact with HDFC Life to distribute their life insurance product. Kind of good question, okay? On which date that is not important. Government appoints Vinay M. Tonse as MD of SBI until 30th of November 2025. Now that is important. The appointment committee of the cabinet. Now that is important, students. Please remember, appointment committee of the cabinet they appoints uh, the MD CEOs of public sector banks. Uh, headed by the prime minister uh, narendra modi they appoint uh, appointed vinay m tonse and he has been appointed as a md of sbi okay now that's really really important star me already laga chuka hu appointed till 
सेबी चीफ माधवी बुच माधवी पुरी बुच नाउ दैट इज रियली इम्पॉर्टेंट शी लॉन्च द इन्वेस्टर रिस्क रिडक्शन एक्सेस आई आर आर ए प्लेटफॉर्म सी मेनी टाइम वट हैपन इज इफ यू हैव अ जीरोधा अकाउंट यू आर डूइंग ट्रेडिंग और यू हैव अ ग्रो अकाउंट और एनी ट्रेडिंग अकाउंट मेनी टाइम्स दीज प्लेटफॉर्म से गो डाउन तो आपको यू डोंट गेट इंफॉर्मेशन रिगार्डिंग योर ट्रेड्स बट नाउ यू कैन गेट द इंफॉर्मेशन ओके नाउ यू कैन गेट दैट इंफॉर्मेशन वाई दिस प्लेटफॉर्म सो इन केस ऑफ अ टेक्निकल ग्लिच यू कैन सेव गार्ड योर सेल्फ यूजिंग द आई आर एर ए आई आर आर ए प्लेटफॉर्म सो रिमेंबर द फुल फॉर्म ऑफ द आई आर आर ए प्लेटफॉर्म इन्वेस्टर रिस्क रिडक्शन एक्सेस और ये काम क्या करता है इन केस ऑफ अ टेक्निकल ग्लिच यू कैन यूज इट ओके एंड दैट्स आई गेस ऑल अबाउट दिस थिंग आफ्टर बेसिक चेक द प्लेटफॉर्म डाउनलोड्स आर द प्लेटफॉर्म डाउनलोड द ट्रेड ऑफ द ट्रेडिंग मेम्बर फ्रॉम ऑल द टेक्निकल फ्रॉम ऑल द ट्रेडिंग वेन्यूज एंड सेंड एस एम एस ई मेल टू द इन्वेस्टर यूजिंग इंटरनेट ट्रेडिंग और द वायरलेस टेक्नोलॉजी ओके इन केस ऑफ अ टेक्निकल ग्लिच आप अपना जो है एस एम एस या ई मेल यू कैन यू नो यू कैन रिक्वेस्ट द एस एम एस और द वाया एस एम एस और ई मेल यू कैन रिक्वेस्ट दैट एंड यूल गेट द डिटेल्स ऑफ द ट्रेड्स ऑफ द ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर डे तो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट मेनी टाइम्स क्या होता है यू हैव द जीरो अकाउंट एंड द ग्रो अकाउंट एंड दर इज अ टेक्निकल ग्लिच एंड यू आर अनेबल टू एक्सेस यूर अकाउंट तो बहुत सारे लॉसेज हो जाते हैं लोगों को मैंने देखा है सो चेयरपर्सन ऑफ द द से बी मधाबी पूरी भुज एंड प्लीज रिमेंबर द नेम ऑफ द प्लेटफॉर्म द आई आर द आई आर आर ए प्लेटफॉर्म ओके एडी बी अप्रूव द यू एस डी सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव मिलियन लोन टू द ग्रीन वे सो ग्रीन वे ग्रामीण इंफ्रा प्राइवेट लिमिटेड दे गॉट द लोन ऑफ सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव मिलियन डॉलर फ्रॉम ए डी बी राइट so this initiative is expected to reduce the greenhouse gas emissions by 3.9 million tons of carbon dioxide okay so greenway gramin infra a private limited they got a 6.5 million dollar loans from adb so let's move forward uh hsbc india and uk export finance they tie up for a 100 million pound financing program right so uh, and this is this has been designed to support Indian MSMEs, right? For Indian uh, MSMEs, this partnership is has been done. Okay. So you uh, HSBC India and UK Export Finance, the Indusind Bank and IGL partner to enable digital rupee transactions in Delhi NCR. The partnership between the Indusind Bank and Indraprastha Gas Limited, they are going to enable the digital uh, rupee, the kind of cryptocurrency, I can say. ऑफ आर बी आई आर बी आई ने लॉन्च करी है डिजिटल रूपी सो इसकी ट्रांजेक्शन इनेबल होंगी डेली में कौन सी डेट से दैट इज नॉट इम्पॉर्टेंट एंड आर बी आई एड्स नाइनटीन अनऑथराइज फॉरेक्स ट्रेडिंग प्लेटफॉर्म लॉट ऑफ फॉरेक्स ट्रेडिंग प्लेटफॉर्म हैज बिन बैंड इन द पास बहुत सारी बैन कर दी हैं और भी कर दी हुई हैं बट ये उतनी इंपॉर्टेंट नहीं है अभी कौन सी करी है कितनी करी है वो छोड़िए एंड सेबी इंट्रोड्यूस सिग्निफिकेंट अमेंडमेंट एट टू थाउजेंड टू मीटिंग ऑफ द सेबी बोर्ड so whichever is important we are going to discuss in the future social stock exchange um, we are going to discuss our regulatory framework for index provider uh, the small and medium real estate investment trust amendment to aif regulation we are going to do all that what was the purpose of changes introduced to social stock exchange in the 203rd sebi board meeting to boost fundraising by not for profit organization on ssc RBI finds Bank of America and HDFC Bank HDFC Bank पे 10 crore का लगा है fine was fined for accepting deposits uh, from non-residents and flouting RBI's uh, directions under the the LRS scheme of FEMA for HDFC Bank and Bank of America इन पे लगा so students SBI circle based officer 2023 course it's available on bankexamstudy.com in which we are providing video classes notes quizzes live sessions and interview preparation course the link is available in the description in which we provide uh, the video classes notes quizzes and the test series right this is our whatsapp number where you can ask your doubts and we are going to answer your doubts okay so list of our successful students who took our courses in the past and they cracked their respective exams this is for pnbsu credit officer 2023 
All these students that took our courses in the past and they cracked their respective exams and I'm really, really happy for them. So I hope you like the today's session. If there is any doubt in your mind, please ask your doubts on the comment section and I'm going to answer your doubts. So that's all for today, students.